We will no longer condone situation whereby northern children are kidnapped, sold, and their tribe and religion change. Kano Emia. And before we hit the news, who is selling these children and who, who are those people kidnapping them? And where are they sending them to? These should be the questions we should be asking ourselves. And come to think of it, all these things did not start it today. You don't take. You understand? This matter, you don't take grand, take, take. Nobody today start. But why is it that you leaders do not speak out? You leaders do not want to, you know, do the need for in that region. Well, Nigerians have reacted. This statement, when you make, I'm waiting to talk, just the, you know, the cast uh, wahala everywhere, left, right, and center. Make me even hear waiting to talk. I'm waiting Nigerians when they react to this statement, talk. But before then, guys, if you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel. I beg, subscribe. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. Emi of Kano Alaji Amino Adobayaro has spoken up against the kidnapping and selling of northern children in the southern part of the country. Addressing newsmen on Saturday, January 6, the Emi who was represented by Dan Maliki Kano, Amib Ahmed Umar, stated that the Emirates would no longer condone the abduction and trading of children in the state. He added that the, the issue had gotten out of hand and proactive action must be taken to curb it. The Emma, Emma said, This ugly trend must stop. We have to rise up against it. We no longer condone a situation whereby our children are kidnapped and sold and their tribe and religion changed. This illicit art must stop. We have to rise up to check the situation as it is getting out of hand. It happened a few years ago, and it has happened again. Only God knows how many of our children have been kidnapped and sold. Make we hear what the Nigerians don't talk. I beg who they sell their children, and who be the buyer, for goodness sake. Best in the go market, spend money, buy trouble. I never heard of such a thing all my life. Even if I am stupid, I will think in that direction. I won't think in that direction. I hope. Are you just saying between the bottom of your heart? The Christian are the victim all the time. And some of your members like, like it that by force. Like it by force way. Because most of those tribes among that core religion are hungry of number at all time. That show that shows us no freedom and clean hearted in that re, uh, re, religions. The Emir said nothing about the fifteen million children out of school in northern Nigeria alone during the Amajiri wandering and begging, thus becoming very vulnerable to anything. The Emir and the others have the resources to better the lot of those deprived, innocent children. Rather, they use them as willing tools for religious extremism and electronic malpractices, giving these children a sense of belonging and whatever vibes would stop. We are useless set of fools. Is it not you that are kidnapping those who are not of your religious and forcefully change their region. Kai, this country, eh? Person when not value his children, is accusing another people. So all this kidnapping in the north is for changing of names and region. Because they are too much, causing problems, tell the northern illiterate to control their child birth rates. Are these people for free? Are they actually unmasking themselves? To trend? Sorry, key. I don't know. Abubaka, which truth is the Emir saying? According to you, you must be a madman, honestly. That is harsh. Whosoever buy those children have brought both Boko Haram terrorists to train in his household. You people are the ones doing that. 
What is he saying? Ask me, oh, this country don't tire me. Anybody can just come up to say anything. Unfortunately, you have a title to someone that looted the country and not talking about your people whom has become Nigerians' greatest problem. Not you, but Sanusi should be there. Which children, the one that they we concealed in the lorry taking cows to the south, or the ones that they sent as shoe shiners, Obioma, truck pushers, street beggars, etc. Please, Oga, get a fat clay, for nobody will buy Boko Haram children for Kobo. Why is these people not truthful to their people and themselves? Every day, people, uh, people are being kidnapped, killed, raped, collect tax from poor farmers. Yet, the support don't care to talk about this show of shame and demonic action. But talking about kidnapped and changed to other religious how? Well, Nigerians, and I don't see answer. When people they talk say, hey, when you look at the situation of the North, you understand that they are leaders. They are the real problem they are facing. You know? hmm. I don't talk this in Tete. That the day these people will stand up to say, oh, we are tired of this business so that is going on in this region. Then, all this will allow stop. But for the fact that they are not yet tired, it won't stop. They will be the one to stop it. Not even the government. The Northern, the Northern, the Northern um, leaders will be the one to stop all this problem in their region because they know how it all started and they know the communities where all these things are going on they know their names they know their the hideout of these people so why can't you just put a stop to all this all this madness for once well now don't hear the matter I beg we're not going to talk make we hear kindly share your thoughts below the comment section i beg not forget to subscribe to this channel